dimension improvements. This is a half section of shaft. When you finish the general sketch and try to modify the dimension as you want, you may find that the actual dimension you need is quite different from the current sketch, which may deform your sketch. To avoid this kind of deformation, we can scale the whole sketch proportionally when you are modifying the only one dimension. Ok, first, we will enable this function. You can find this option in the configuration menu here. Take it. Now, try to modify the dimension again. You can see that the whole sketch is scaled. This is the first improvement. Then, let's add dimension. Why don't you try to modify the dimension in sketch? Normally, you have to modify it one by one to get the result you want. But now, with the new dimension batch editor features, you can easily select multiple dimensions and modify it conveniently. Let's take this as an example. Right click on any dimension and select dimension editor. Then, select all the dimensions you want to modify. You can easily manage all the dimension in the dimension editor. You can tick the regenerate option, then the preview will be refreshed automatically. Also, we provide two methods to modify the dimension in batch. You can set a global increment for all selected dimensions. The second method is log ratio. Then, the program will store the current ratio and change other selected dimensions based on the modified dimension. This is the main improvement we made in 2022 version. Thanks for watching.